That's not Saturn, that's Neptune. NASA just released this new photo of Neptune taken by JWST, which shows its rings in incredible detail, but it shows a lot more than that too. Some of Neptune's dust rings haven't been seen in 30 years because they're so faint. Last time that anybody saw these rings was in 1989 when Voyager 2 got incredibly close to Neptune because that was the only way it could see these faint rings. These two photos were taken when Voyager 2 was only 280,000 kilometers away from Neptune. This was taken from over 4 billion kilometers away, which shows just how powerful JWST is. Now, Neptune in general looks pretty dark, and that's because it has methane gas in its atmosphere, and methane gas absorbs red and infrared light. JWST photographs in infrared light. That's why it doesn't look like this. Neptune does have high altitude methane ice clouds, and those show up really bright. And this is the craziest part. Neptune has a 164 year long orbit, and right now its North Pole is faced away from Earth, so we can't see it. But you can tell from this image that it's surprisingly bright up there, so it'll be a fun surprise for when we can see it. Neptune also has a vortex at its south pole, so who knows what's at the other end. And in the same image, JWST was able to capture seven of Neptune's 14 known moons. Neptune's biggest moon, Triton, looks incredibly bright, and that's because it's literally covered in a frozen sheet of nitrogen, so it reflects 70% of the sunlight that hits it. I just hope this this photo makes people understand how underrated Neptune is.